I bought something. Don't look at me like that. My body and this TV, shut the f up. I bought something. Don't look at me. But it's something that I needed and something that was something that will make my videos better. Don't even look at me. A tripod. Cause you guys know that I used to like just stack books and that would be my tripod, <laughs> but not anymore. Are you kidding me? So now I don't have to stress about filming. Cause now I can literally just film anywhere. This is everything. All right guys, it's been um, a week. I'm doing a lot better, thank God. Cause whoa, that was rough. <laughs> it was really bad. Like my depressive episode was really, really bad. I'm doing a lot better. I'm applying for jobs. <laughs> God. Please subscribe so I don't have to get a nine to five. Oh, new slogan. I have no idea what I'm doing in this video, but I guess we'll figure it out. But before we figure it out, here's a word from today's sponsor. If you think you might be feeling stressed, anxious, or overwhelmed, today's sponsor, BetterHelp, is here to help you. BetterHelp offers licensed therapists who are trained to listen and help you. You can choose to talk to your therapist in a private online environment at your own convenience. And there's a broad range of expertise because there's over like 20,000 licensed therapists in BetterHelp's network. So it gives you access to therapists that might not even be available in your area, which is great. And all you have to do is just fill out a simple questionnaire and you can be matched with a therapist in as little as 48 hours. From there, you can schedule secure phone and video sessions. Plus you can exchange unlimited messages and of course everything is confidential and the best part is that you can switch your therapist at no cost anytime so if this is something that interests you or someone you know join the three million plus people who have taken charge of their mental health with an experienced better help therapist you can get 10 percent off your first month at betterhelp.com slash steve maria and the link is also in the bio yes let's go where? Who knows? Every time I want to get an iced coffee, it's like minimum $7 with tip. So it's just like, I can't afford that. And granted, yes, I can just make my coffee at home, but it just doesn't hit the same. My friend Katie actually introduced me to 7-Eleven coffee. First of all, every seventh drink you literally get for free. I sound like an ad. I need to stop talking about it until 7-Eleven um, gives me a sponsorship. You literally fill it up with cold brew and then you put your creamer in and they have non-dairy creamers so it's literally perf and it's huge and it's only like 250. It depends on like what location but usually it's like 250. I forgot my fucking wallet at home. No, bro. What the fuck? I'm like literally driving right now. <laughs> How the fuck did I do that just now? No! Okay, an entire day did pass. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, guys. Okay, listen, to slowly get out of depression, you have to like at least regress a little bit. So it was just a clusterfuck. And I was also filming a TikTok vlog. So it was like, I got the coffee, but then it spilled all over me. But then I forgot my wallet. But I forgot my wallet first, so I had to go back and get my wallet. But then I went back to the 7-Eleven and then spread all over my white sweatshirt. And then I had to go wash it really quickly so it didn't stain. And then I drove back to 7-Eleven, I got the coffee. And then after that, I'm like, you know what, let me just go to sleep. So that's what I did. So today we're gonna go back to 7-Eleven, go to one <laughs> that fucking works and doesn't spray brown liquid all over me. And we'll just take the day as it comes because I don't know what I'm doing still. You would think I would plan something for the video, right? No. Giving like male model right now. Wait. I can never. I can never. Why are you looking at me? Like, why are you looking at me so much? You are literally a freak. What was I doing? So I kind of came to terms with the point, I mean, I kind of came to terms with the reality that like, not only do I need a job for money, I like actually want one now. Oh my God, I can't believe I just said that. What the fuck? I love being alone. That's like one of my biggest philosophies in life is learn how to be alone because people can't do that. It's a skill. I think I've just been alone for so long and I'm just like, I'm just very lonely and have been for like a very long time. And it's just that type of loneliness that's like a little, it's hard to romanticize, you know? It's just like a little too much now. 
where don't get me wrong like i just said love alone time but like whoa never in my life would i think i think i would say i want to work la 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 Listen, is it the best coffee I've ever had? Absolutely not. But is it cheap? And is, does it taste okay? Yeah, so I'll take it. So I think the problem with me right now is that I have no hobbies, no interests, no shows to watch, no books to read. Actually, I do. I literally do have books to read and shows to watch, but for some reason I cannot, I just can't bring myself to watch a show or finish a book or just anything. It's actually a little upsetting, a little scary. But that's okay, because the whole point of today's video is that I'm gonna try to find a hobby. Something that I can just do during the day, during my phase of unemployment, that can just fill my day. Because whoa, do these days drag on. These days just, they seem to never end. Watch your fucking car. You're about to fucking hit me, relax. I used to do makeup, like I fully used to do full on makeup. So maybe I'll try doing an eye look, even though I really don't want to, but we'll try. We'll try, we'll see how it goes. Okay, I'm deranged because I'm, I'm so hard on myself. I say I don't have any hobbies. I have two albums that are self-produced and self-written on Apple Music and Spotify. I have a hobby, it's making music. So let me get back into that, hello. So I'm gonna go to Best Buy, get a microphone, cause I lost mine, and I'm gonna record an original song and I'm gonna do a makeup look. So come on. These hobbies, it's gonna be it's gonna be How does a PC Richard and Son not have a microphone? Like, how do they not have mics? Okay, <laughs> it doesn't make sense to me, but okay. <laughs> okay, microphones just don't exist. They're just not existing. Like, they literally said they don't know where microphones are. So, I guess I'm just gonna have to wing it. When you're a genius, whatever. Okay, I just got back. I got Casetify PR, love that. So let's open it together before we get into the shenanigans, shall we? Um, okay packaging. This is so cute, what the fuck? They gave me three cases, that's very generous. This one has my name on it, Steven, it's a black case, cool. Coolio, clouds, question mark, cool. I'm fucking obsessed. This one, wait, I need another one. This one is everything. These little creatures, I'm obsessed with this one. Yeah, thanks Casetify, mwah. Okay, I think I'm gonna found my new calling and a new hobby and it's ASMR. So let's try it out. I'm gonna do a recording on my computer. Testing. Oh, okay. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a very, very, very Oh wait, maybe I shouldn't say that. so fucking dry that's literally disgusting and low-key makes me want to die so i'm never gonna do that again i'm actually gonna hydrate because i feel like every single time i talk i can hear the spit in my mouth and it's so disgusting so let me just hydrate my mouth a little bit with some iced iced Okay, so as I said before, I have so many makeup palettes because I used to do, like I used to be really into it, but it just, all of a sudden, I just completely stopped. It's like, I'm not into this anymore. All right. So I have Conspiracy. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. Everyone bought it. Blood Sugar Jawbreaker. Damn, I was on a Jeffree Star kick. I have the James Charles palette. Oh my God. Look at this, Jaclyn Hill palette. The Nicole Guerrero highlighter, 
Jeffree Star Thirsty. You're doing amazing, sweetie. I used to be really into makeup, but maybe let me just try like an eye look. Like, let me just do it, you know? Like, why not? Cause maybe this will be a hobby. Maybe I like will be into like makeup. Ugh. I'm gonna use the Jaclyn Hill palette. I even had this. Like, look at how many brushes I had. Holy shit, this is so crazy. Okay, um, I'm gonna take this brush. This is a Morphe Jeffree Star brush. I'm gonna do this color. Pick it up on the brush, tap the excess. I'm gonna go right in the crease with this one. Did that even show up? I need a mirror. Starting off strong, gonna blend it out. Okay, now let's do a little darker. Let's go in with maybe this, this one, like this one right here. I don't know any names, so don't ask. Maybe I'll put this like right in there. Maybe like tap it in and then buff it out. Look at me using all these like makeup lingo. Buff it out, contour. Um, okay. Skin. Sorry. It sounded just like skin on a microphone because I don't have any nails. Oh my god, if anyone has like a remedy for that, I pick my nails. Like it's a nervous habit. It's so embarrassing. So if anyone has a remedy for curing that, let a bitch know because like I'm just counting down the days until my finger gets infected. Like it's gonna be fun. Okay, maybe I'll go in with, maybe I'll go a little, okay, maybe I can use a different brush. I'm gonna use this pencil brush and put a darker mauve or whatever this color is in the corner, like right there. Put it in my crease like that. And then I'll take the other brush again and blend it out. Not me being a makeup guru. Well, actually men shouldn't be in makeup. So the fact that I'm doing this, it's a little gay. It's looking unique. It's okay, I'm gonna buff it out more. Try to do it more and more and more. Yes, yes, yes. I'm getting excited. Oh God, I fucked it up. Oh no, I'm a failure. <laughs> no, the black was not the move. Who the fuck told me to do black? Why would you guys say that? Okay, maybe if I put it under the eye too. No, it's gonna make me look like I have a black eye. <laughs> Okay, so I don't know why I just did that. And then I'll finish it off with some gold sparkle. Okay. Okay, so... What else do ASM artists do? Like, I don't really know. Maybe I could fart. And I wish I was a girl so I could queef. Oh my god. Queefing is probably one of the funniest things on earth. Farting from your vagina. Are you fucking kidding me? That's so funny. I'm dead. This is the sound of an AirPod opening. Oh, okay, I fucked up. <laughs> Fuck. At least I know that. <laughs> I think there was a reason why I quit doing this. It's because I can't. Um, anyway, that was fun. Ugh.
<sighs> Is it working? I can't open my eyes. I feel like it's gonna hurt. Oh God, I can't see this shit. Okay. Did I not just get rid of every single stitch of eye makeup I just had on? That was dope. Okay, if you guys want a good makeup remover, get this from used to the people. Holy shit. Well, I guess I, I guess I'm just gonna stick to what I've been doing, which is nothing and sulking, because hobbies aren't my thing, I guess.